This question asked me to use theorem 1 from the textbook to calculate the Laplace transform of this given function f of t. So let's recall that theorem 1 from the textbook says that the Laplace transform of e to the a t times f of t, where a is just any real constant, is equal to f of s minus a. So basically, take the Laplace transform of f of t as usual, and then once you're done, everywhere you see an s, replace it with an s minus a. Okay, so I'm given a function, t squared times e to the negative 3t. So I know I'm going to be using theorem 1 because I've got that e to the negative 3t right there. And I can identify a as negative 3. So now I just want to take the Laplace transform of t squared. So let's recall how to take the Laplace transform of t to some power. So the Laplace transform of t to the n is going to be n factorial over s to the n plus 1. So for t squared, that's going to be 2 factorial, so 2 over t to the third. So now I just want to swap, oh, this should be an s, I'm sorry. So now I want to swap that s for an s plus 3. And I found the Laplace transform of f of t.